Hey everyone, so it's July 11th, 2014, and I'm feeling sad. I'm outside of the DMV of New Hampshire, where I was asking the government for permission to drive the car that I just bought, and I was denied. I was asking for temporary permission, 20-day plates that a person can acquire if they purchase a new vehicle. Uh, but the paperwork that I have is not the right paperwork. Uh, it's the dealership's fault, apparently, or my fault for not knowing all the rules uh, about what sort of paperwork one needs to get proper permission from the government to drive my own property. Uh, they're not sure that my property is safe. That's what they're alleging. They're saying, no, you can't have our permission to drive your car because we don't know that it's safe. The reason it was considered unsafe at the time of the purchase was because the blinker was out. You know, an easy fix. So I, I got that fixed at Meineke and it's done. It was like $15 in 15 minutes. But the government can't trust that it's safe to drive. So what I have to do is somehow get it inspected by the government so that they can say, okay, yeah, this car is safe to drive. But I can't get it to inspection without having plates. Do you see the problem here? I'm, I'm here at the DMV asking for the plates. They're saying, well, we can't give you plates if it's not inspected. And I'm saying, well, I can't get it inspected if I don't have plates. So the solution is to get regular registration. I can't get temporary registration, but the woman told me you can get regular registration. If you go to your town clerk and you register the car in New Hampshire, then you'll have 10 days to get the car inspected. Then I'd be good for a year. $100 gets me permission to drive for a year. $100 plus whatever inspection costs. But I'm not sure I want to do that. I'm not sure I want to register my car in New Hampshire. I have a business in Montana and they offer permanent registration. So perhaps I should sell the car to the business in Montana and get it registered there. Just something I'm considering. If it's going to be a waiting game here in New Hampshire of trying to ask permission, giving government agents money and filling out forms waiting for postage if it's going to be the same game in New Hampshire or Massachusetts or in uh, Montana why wouldn't I do permanent registration get it all finished once and then never have to deal with these people again what do you think what should I do what would you do this is the seventh time I've been to this DMV in the last month, if you can believe it. This is my time they're taking. Money, I don't care about. You can make more money. Time, you can never get back.